Right. So I've got Lanu back. She's thoroughly distracted trying to destroy this chest. And I realized that I hadn't explored a dock area over here. And uh, I see this fellow, a shady character, aptly named. Hmm. All right. What if I do know how to live in the shadows? Oh. Okay, let's see what you have to offer. Mmm. Ooh, he sells very nice things. Including crap loads of traps. <laughs> wow. Traps are so pricey. But that means he'll buy traps too. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I think I have at least one that I just. Aha! Ten gold. That's terrible. Oh well. Hmm, I've got some stuff to identify. Magic bag, 20%. Yeah. Let me sell that. This armor over here. Banded mail plus one. Or armor of comfort. I cannot unequip armor during combat? Oh, Linu! Oh my god. Nothing but trouble, that one. I have lots of magic bags now. That's 40. That's 40. That's 20, so I'm gonna sell that. Wait. Uh, sell it. Yes. Let me get rid of some dragon blood. Anyway, uh, I think that's about it. I just sell some of this extra. Oh, Earth's Ring. Right. Degree of Insight. Four plus five. I guess I'll keep it for now. Sell that. Sell that. Shurikens. Sell that. Hmm. Mm, that. I think that's just about everything I want to sell. Don't need that. Don't need that. Wish I could get rid of that. <laughs> Don't really need a zoo key anymore. All right, we're gonna go. Uh... Oh wait, we're gonna go in this dock house. Anybody home? Oh. Well, who are you fellows? Should have known I couldn't trust you. Things get a little too risky for you and suddenly the greater upon price isn't good enough. Captain Mung of what exactly? And Pritchev. So, what are you guys doing in here? Hey pal, business is business. I do you a favor and you do one right back for me, all right? And this has nothing to do with risk. This is a very slow conversation, so while you guys are talking... Besides, if I started doing things under the kindness of my heart, I wouldn't be in business now, would I? I do as I... I do as I... something. Ah. I give out the jobs and you take them. I need this ship to never winter. If you want work, you'll take this package. Interesting. Secret shipment of something, perhaps? Well, the difference is between a wealthy shipment to Waterdeep and a trip into that plague-ridden town. Count me out. Hmm. All right, dear. I thought they cured the plague. It. Anything else? How am I supposed to reason with you? The plague has been cured, and those citizens are desperate. Put yourself in their shoes. Oh, I couldn't pick the lock. Yeah. 
I don't trust what people say about a plague that can kill you. I'm staying away. I'm not bringing that ship into Goddess winter. Take you now! Hey, bash this. Nope. No, why? Okay, well, I might as well start talking to these guys. You believe that, chump? I've got a chance to ship some marble into Waterdeep, and that's some good gold in the deal, and he's throwing morality at me. Who are you? Captain Mung, and I own the boat that bring any goods from Port Last to points beyond, points that, beyond that I choose. But that no good dock master is making my life miserable. Tell me, would you be shipping into Neverwinter when you could be off to Waterdeep? Hmm. Tell me the truth. I want details. That bomb wants me to go to Neverwinter and they got plague there. I'm not risking my life to deliver some food and supplies. Especially not when my choice is risking my life or getting some marble to Waterdeep for real payday. I'm take talking good money. Let me go talk to the dock master. Wait. Oh, I was going to say, let Hello. me go. Ugh. Talk to the dock master. Pritchev. I greet you. Who are you? Pritchev. Right. Uh, I want to hear this. Two shipments. One to Waterdeep, one to Neverwinter. The Waterdavian shipment is worth more, but the Neverwinter packages for relief put together by the citizens of Portlast. Good Captain Mung's only got room for one shipment. Of course, he wants the money for the valuable shipment, but the people of Neverwinter need this relief. Uh... I'll speak with the captain about taking the Neverwintian shipment. Out of the goodness of my heart. No. I spoke to the dock master and I want you to change your mind. Uh, I don't believe the plague is cured. Uh, persuade. I know, but I know it is. I'm from Neverwinter. Okay. Uh, insight? What if I pay you to cover the... Can I try that again? No. I want the Persuade. Win all those Neverwinter stars so you can get some extra gold. Aha! Success! I greet you. Uh... 200 gold. That's good. Thank you! Helping Neverwinter was the right thing. Cool. I would take the experience and the gold for something that required almost no work at all. That's how we do. All right, now we finally head north. Finally. Let's get out of here and onto stuff in this chapter. Is the sarcophagus? Victory will be ours. Do what? Whatever is in the sarcophagus. Come on. Ooh. I'll take greenstone. What's this thing? I just can't help it. Look, look. Ah, oh, it's locked. I can do that. Sorry. What are these? Nothing. Fine, fine. Let's go north. To the north. I haven't really gotten into many fights, or any fights really, except for that one werewolf one, so I'm suspecting that the fights are going to be far more difficult here than they were in the first chapter. It's going to be like starting the first chapter Hello, all over again. Ooh. Must be careful treading the road around these parts. A dangerous place these days. Listen, old Gerald. Gerald? Hmm. Ah. You're Gerald. Your son mentioned you. Oh, okay, what kind of help do you need? Okay. Uh, the hills in this area are home to creatures of all sorts. Bugbears, goblins, and the like. I want to see what a bugbear is. Normally, they don't trouble us much. Since the Luskins stop patrolling the area, mind you, they become plenty brave. For weeks now, they've been attacking anyone passing through these parts. Attacking farm a few times, too. And that's when they made off with my wife. Oh, dear. I figure it's all that Derigabs? Derigabs? doing. Damn ogre will get what's coming to him one way or another, I swear it. Okay. What's this about your wife? Leah is her name. She was taken from the farm one evening when the boy and I were out scouting the hills. Nothing we could have done about it. Well, you seem pretty, you know, laid back about this. These creatures have never shown any interest in taking folk before. I'm not even sure why they should start now. Derrid gabs behind it, I'm sure, though. 
We don't need pray that she's all right yet. I'll get her back somehow, and then that ogre will pay for all the grief he's caused. Okay. Who is Derek Yab? <laughs> An ogre mage. Oh, great. So he's not only super strong, but he's a mage too. He's gonna kick my ass, I'm sure. A rather cunning sort who's decided he's just the critter to lead all those monsters. How he got it into his head, I haven't a clue, but from what I can tell, he's gone and built himself an army. What he intends to do with it scares me just a little. I went and sent a warning off to my old friend Aaron Gend, but I haven't heard back from him yet. I suppose he's got more important things in his place right now, considering all considered. Hmm. You know Aaron Gend? Yes, he does. Alright. Uh, why would Luskin stop patrolling? I kind of want to know that. You haven't heard since the Neverwinchian Plague? The Luskin's gone and shut their walls up tight. No one goes in, no one goes out. I never liked their soldiers much. They act like bandits sometimes the way they act. Since they stopped patrolling, however, it makes you realize what worse things they kept in check. I see. Uh, perhaps I could help. Maybe you could. Maybe I can. Uh, oh, I wouldn't be the first adventurer to head into the hills. There have been other adventurers? A few, and none have returned. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I'll look into it as soon as I can. I have to find proof of what's happened to her and bring me his head. Sure, I can do that. Maybe. You are supposed to come this way first, so... Hopefully, it, the fight won't be too incredibly difficult. He has a chest! Sorry, just drinking some tea. Got a bit of a sore throat, I'm afraid. Again, for like... This is like the second time in a month. I thought I had licked it, but apparently... Not. I hope he has not trapped his chest. Yum yum yum! Anything else in here? Nope. This guy is officially cleaned out. Ba, ba, ba. Did you just say detect mode? The new why detect mode? What do we got over here? Oh, let's check to see what's behind his house first, I guess. Oh, what a lovely flower garden. Hmm. Oh, and he's got some chickens. This guy's got it made in the shade, except for the fact that his wife got abducted. But other than that... And his... I don't know. Chicken... Barn or something? Stones. I wonder who's hiding all this random money under stones around here. Doggy! And he's got his own little dock. Hm, very nice. Anyway. Let's have to clear up the map here. Make sure I haven't missed anything. Nothing over here, I guess. Tab says no. Oh, wait. Can I, uh... There's stuff in the corner, but I can't get there. Hmm. I guess we're going to be going... Up. Always up. Do, 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 do. Lovely view. Nice walk in the woods. Never did anybody no harm. Random cow. Hello, random cow. I don't know what you're doing all the way up here, but... Whatever. This whole area has a very... angular feel to it. 
my dear! Hello- Oh my god, what the fuck is that? Warg? What the hell is a warg? Don't worry, little dear thing. I have saved you. What the fuck is a warg? And why was it- It looked like a giant evil black wolf, essentially. And there's nothing here. Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm sorry your dear friend died. <laughs> if I was a ranger, I could probably talk to it. Or druid, or, you know, anything along those lines. Prip. Do we have a signpost? We do. Sign says... East Neverwinter Neverwinter Woods, South Portlast, North Green Griffin Inn in Luskin. All right, so that's the wood. We don't want to go there yet, really. What the fuck, Lenu? Uh, there's another war. The Where do these things keep coming from? Yeah. A giant black wolf. Seriously, they don't even drop anything. Ugh. Oh well. Free experience, it's fine. So, what lies yonder? Up here we have some more stones. Very nice. Always like digging around in the dirt. Good thing to do. Fun pastime. Um. Whoa! Who arrowed me? Goblins! Goblins, goblins, goblins! <laughs> uh, that was amazing, Lanu. It, it truly was. The ex my explosion was also equally amazing. These goblin stuff's all over the place. Oh, and they all drop things. This is great. I want to fight goblins all the time. Look how much stuff they drop. Hey. Some garbage. Just randomly. So, we have a cave. That's just called cave, so I don't really know what's in it. Anything up here? Nope. Oh, we also have another cave. There are two. That's great. And over here? Hmm. What could this be, I wonder? Looks as if they were some random... Oh, a third cave. And they're all just called cave. That's so useful game. Thanks. These looked like some random fortifications that got, I don't know, attacked or something. Also cave. Anything else around here besides caves? Anything at all? What the hell's glowing so big? Oh, the cave. Right. Right, right, right. Is that the end? Yep, this is the entrance to Luskin, I guess. Alright, so, hmm. Guess maybe I should head into one of these caves, huh? See what happens. Bugbear caves. Well, apparently, bugbears are just giant goblins, because that's essentially what they look like. Or, I don't know, what I imagine ogres would look like in this game. Or orcs. Not ogres. They already showed ogres. There's a lot of them here. They're very easy to kill, but there's an awful lot. And they only give me 15 experience, which is actually slightly disappointing. Oh well. 